Freedom Tour 2023. September 3rd, Sunday. Day four, the Wu Sun Wu Kong Chase. Another hat. Oh, another book. And some. Ooh, a free uh, mystery shard. Guardian ring. All right. All right. Don't care. What do we got? Still can't do anything with Call the Arbiter. Mystery shard. Look at that. Daily quest. How are you guys today? Welcome back to the free to play extravaganza with the finds of that. Wait, why is that so loud? So I was recording the other. That's my fault. I was recording last yesterday, obviously. I was recording a Starfield episode. Which I think I didn't put live. I should probably do that. That's been fun. I mean, I'm not getting hardly any views, but I almost, honestly, I really don't think I care. I think it's just fun. Uh, hit public, publish it. I got 93. I'm up to 93 on the first one. Just put everyone that's subscribed. We'll be streaming that later today, but today we're talking about this. Hey, uh, today I want to talk to you a little bit about uh, your uh, car's extended warranty. Just kidding. Uh, I want to talk to you about main account. First of all, can't tell you how great it is to not play it. Oh, I got second chest already. Look at me. Boom. Uh, well, might as well keep it. You never know, right? Um, well, let's start with this. Uh, it's been going exceedingly well uh, by the way we are now uh, four star so that's where I'm at I've opened up potions let's start with this we'll, we'll do this and we'll talk about the other we'll talk about the main account and then I'll go through what what I did offline uh, so we uh, so you know I'm still playing the main account just kind of in the loosest terms uh, you know, doing my clan boss keys. I do, whew, I do. There is one thing I have to do, unfortunately, fortunately or unfortunately, um, in order to ensure that I'm, uh, going to maintain, I have to do my arena 3v3 battles just to get me safe because of course I was doing one man defenses. Uh, I won't take my defense out. Uh, that way I don't have to worry about it, but I, I did, I, I do have to get back up. So, so that's a thing. Um, when you're not, when you're trying not to play an account anymore, cheers. Uh, it's frightening how much time like you know how much time we know it's a it's a well documented feature or lack of but i don't think i was quite ready for how much time when you're not doing it anymore like when i'm up here i'm watching videos i'm playing around with raid you don't realize how much of a time suck it is but when you're when you're trying to do the opposite, when you're actively engaged in doing the opposite. Holy crap, that's a lot of time. It felt like I would never end. It felt like I was never going to stop playing Raid Shadow Legends. And it's I've, all I'm adding to it is the 3v3, right? Doing two, if I ever remember, I'll do more, but two doing the two keys for sure for Clan Boss. And the 3v3, I did the Hydra one on one day, so that's longer, but that's, that's fine. But that's really all I've been doing on that. And it was just crazy to me how long that's taken. 
Uh, thank you all for your submissions. I'm going to stick with the Freedom Tour 2023. I kind of like it. Makes you feel like a rock star. Starfield is so addicting. I was up again late last night, so I'm tired. And today, <laughs> today, Intelecom decided to, uh, really, I'm like level 22. You're already giving me. Uh, Intelecom decided they were going to do a, my parcel pickup on a return at an, a, an early Sunday. So that I didn't like. Okay, so where we're at, uh, I did run all the keeps um, to whatever level. They're all kind of level six. I think maybe level seven on the spirit keep. Yeah, because I have the block. Um, seven, arcane, obviously. I don't think I only did the two because it was just what I needed. Uh, and then four on the force keep. Maybe I didn't keep going. I don't have a force champion yet, so I didn't want to spend too much time on that. Uh, we ran one minotaur, minotaur tar. We ran up to stage five. I feel like if I can get to stage seven where we can start getting five star gear, we might do some dragon runs. Just burn some of this energy in there just for some just for some gear. Just for some gear upgrades, you know. Uh and then we are still we're in the deadlands, which I don't know if that's further ahead than we were or not. I don't remember where we stepped off last night. Or last yesterday, so that's where we're at. Um, it's been running pretty smooth. Uh, I've got Death Hal in there. You can see him. He's got a poison, and he ignores like block damage or something. He, he or defense. He he does something on his A one, but uh, he's an easy, common champ that you can use early for a couple poisons. Until you get something better, which of course we're not really pulling shards, uh, so it'll be a while before we see something better, right? So this that you saw our clan boss team. That's it. That's the that's the dream team. But uh, just a simple way. I mean, if we see um, outlaw monk, we'll put him in as instead of uh, rock heal reductioner. We also got the top reward, some some uh, underwhelming speed gear. So we did switch over the damage gear to Kale for right now. Obviously, when we get Mr. Wukong, then we will use that gear on him. And then Kale gets the dirty leftovers. He's like the younger, longer, younger brother. He'll just get the leftovers. He'll get the hand-me-downs. Do they still do that? Is that still a thing? I feel like growing up, there was the rich kids that had Dolce. No, nah, it wasn't Dolce Cabana. Who was the what was the big '90s? Like in Canada, we have Roots, which is kind of a, a Canadian centric uh, clothier. Old Navy was is kind of standard. But back then, it was like. Maybe maybe it was like the maybe it was Banana Republic, but I feel like there's one other one I'm missing it. And I always had their shirt, but uh, there's always that group of people that you knew they were getting their kids their their parents hand me downs, and there might be the odd asshole kid that would mock them about it, but we didn't. We just felt like, well, that's that's sorry. Like, wait, what do you say? Oh, sorry. You're, uh, you've got to you've go. We're going to lose this. Uh, it's not my fault that you have a, uh, have an older brother or sister. But I don't think we ever thought that poorly of him. Like, it's his fault. The problem is the order here. We've got bad order. All right. Summon three champions. I'm up to three ancient shards already. I don't know what the what's the what what do you think's the play on the shards? I obviously wait for a two x, but do we wait for the 
first 2x? Because I don't think I'll be done building my initial core. And certainly something we pull could change everything. But is it is that the play or is the play to save it for a, a bigger event? Well, I kind of feel bad for her in there if we can get some level ups. Yeah, I gotta see. So I I took the lifesteal boots and put them on Kale because he needed them. But I might now that we got that lifesteal helmet, I'm gonna take a look because I think I put a crappy um, weapon on him too just to get the lifesteal. So after this round, I'll take a look at that. It's all about gear management, my friends. That's all the beginning is is running these and gear management. And hopefully get into level seven of the dragon. Uh, that's where our Kale absolutely excels over uh, Elhane, especially on the dragon. Because poisons are such a, a a strong killer. Uh, so, okay, yeah, see, we did that. So we can remove that. And then we're going to remove that. And we'll upgrade this. <laughs> this will only matter till we get the boots from Sun Wukong. Or did, is that the first thing we got with the boots? First thing we got is the boots. That's why I have boots. Well, that was actually not a bad crit rate and speed with an attack. It's pretty good. So we st now we have the four. And we can bring up like this, right? Uh, so I need to, I mean, maybe it's too soon to care, but that's 140, it's 129. I don't, I don't think there's going to be a hope. Maybe, maybe what we'll do just so because if I can get the order that changes that changes everything maybe we'll go into the dungeon just just for not that oh dear god not that one maybe we'll go into the dragon's lair I don't think I'm ready for a higher level yet let's see because boy it would be nice if I could get them in the right order oh right raid has been crashing daily randomly by the way i haven't had this since like year one the first year it used to crash a lot and we used to always be like why do we lose our energy and the reason you lose your energy is because so you can't cheat and quit just uh someone said hey give me your referral links post them i posted my referral links and nobody's using them oops that seems suspicious all right let's try this again without crashing they just can't handle the dream team just can't handle oh this one's this one is crazy because of shatter bones His second hit is very... Oh, well, he ain't getting a second hit, so. Our Death Hound isn't hitting very hard right now. If we can get Outlaw Monk and Death Hound in there, then we can actually, as crazy as it sounds, get some progression in... Uh, actually, be good for here, too. Again, that one poison is more than you, you can actually expect out of a filler position, in my opinion. That's We'll take that. Oh, because Force Affinity, that's the problem here. Oh, we didn't get... Uh... 
Feels like the dragon's doing all the wrong turn order on things. Doesn't doesn't he do the poison first and then the the decrease attack? That was weird. Well, if we can do stage seven, this would be a good place to put some energy. What I'd really like to see is just a couple speed pieces, just so I can get Deacon faster. Or one sp speed boots would be preferably from speed gear, but not. Oh, that's not good. I hate this level so much. I had forgotten to what level, to what degree, sorry, I hate this level. Because you don't think about it. But putting any sort of block damage in a wave is, um, is so rude. So rude, Plarium. So I don't, I, I don't think we've had any um, crazy update. Oh, look at that. Oh, good, we didn't. Um, to Mythical. I mean, it's going to be this week, right? Tuesday, probably, or Wednesday. I forget that date was on it. Um, it's going to be so nice to not be a part of that rat race. I would absolutely love it if they surprised us, but... Uh, the one thing I will say about Plarium is they are consistent. And unfortunately, it's consistently disappointing. Well, it's re he's resisting. We need, uh, we need some better gear. But we did get through. I wonder if I can improve that. The two remaining pieces. Yikes. Really don't have a whole lot to go with. <laughs> this is the cycle you get to play, right? Need better gear with accuracy. We could do that gives me eleven. It still gives me, it gives me a little baby shield. This one here Let's see if I can uh like why 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 lock it why why lock these these auto battles it's just stop people like oh no don't upgrade you I guess it's to say like I shouldn't take stuff to level 12 yes nailed it holy bollocks I don't see why not. This stuff's going to last me forever. I remember my last free-to-play account. I had four-star gear for ever. Because you just couldn't get, like, especially lifesteal. This looks like rolling my main account gear. Especially lifesteal. You keep it until you get it. Like, until you get a legit replacement. For the clan boss, it has to be in lifesteal. So it was always that kind of forever cycle. Most wanted champion for this account. Oh, more speed. <laughs> Oops. And then I don't want to do those because I don't want to get more speed yet. So we'll, we'll leave it like this for now. It's got some good health. I wonder if this means I can... Can I get something better? Yep. Equip. So I don't have a better chest. Oh, did I forgot to destroy? Oh, that's my bad. So that gives him something a little bit better. How's she doing? She's still on all that eight piece. Oh, there's the gear I need, but he can get nothing. Okay. That's just unfortunate. At least we killed one. Did you get frozen and then got removed buff? I don't have masteries. That was weird. Did you guys see that? 
Kill removed his buff. He got frozen from the first one, but removed her buff. Well, I'll be... Call me Susie and spin me around. Washington State won, or Washington won yesterday. Washington Huskies beat Boise um, ridiculously. It was, I felt bad. Like, it's one of those things where you, it's like a train wreck. Like, you don't want to watch, but you can't turn away. <coughs> Boise got hammered, which is good for watching. Washington's a top 25, an AP 25 team. They have an outside chance at the Pac-12 before the Pac-12 disintegrates and they leave to the other conferences, which is absolutely crazy to me that that's even happening. Uh, so we can do this. Um, so we can do that. I don't want to spend the whole time doing that. That feels reductive. But I'll go back to that. I'll probably put some turns in it while I'm playing Starfield. Don't, you don't want to put too much energy in that low, but just getting some good budget gear to get your first five champions that you're going to use everywhere, which is, is you know, it's kind of essential. It's kind of, I wouldn't say essential, but it's it's a it's a smart move, in my opinion. Uh, I'd love to hear you for your players, if you agree... On spending any energy in dragon. I know a lot of people say, oh no, no, just go farm that level's boss and you can get rare gear and you can get three star gear and that sort of stuff just to get your guys. But at normal level difficulty, uh, you're getting awful gear. And so I think that's a waste. It's like I don't wanna I don't wanna farm like here's where we get War Maiden. And I'll still get a War Maiden, because you never know with Affinities how useful that might be. Plus, she's still going to be good in Faction Wars. I use War Maiden... Do I still? Yeah, I still, on my main, I was still using War Maiden. Also, a uh, question about the main. So I talked about I'm truly doing as bare minimum as I can. I'm not even doing dailies. I'm, not, I'm literally just doing Clan Boss, and then I was doing the 3v3... So that I can keep gold three. And then I only have to do ten battles a week there to maintain. Um, should I be maintaining my faction wars? I feel like it's ten minutes of my day at most. Well, there's a couple that might be three or four minute runs. But I think most of them are like one to two minute runs. So just getting the, just doing them, I don't think that hurts. It's not like I need to stockpile the resource, though. I have enough of the resource, so it would just be the glyphs. I'm curious as to your opinion. Leave your opinion down below. Or should I just let that be? <clears throat> I just was kind of like, I think I did it last time. Oh, Shield Guard. So we might, we might work at Shield Guard. Shield Guard is a uh, wonderful... That I've never built. Never built a Shield Guard, so that might be worthwhile. He's a good farmer for 12-3. when we get there right i've never built him i don't know what stats he needs i don't know i don't know anything about him but because we haven't done it before it seems like a perfect time to do so so we're gonna get uh we're gonna get death hound and rock tooth to 30 and then we're going to swap in some food. Is what we're going to be running here. That's kind of my goal. There we go. Arbiter seems happy. Got some got some life gear. That's good. Got that. What do we need? Increase champions level? Sure, we'll do that. Also, by the way, uh, I did pull out the missions and... Um, we can keep going on these. Like, obviously, 
but uh, I thought it was a good idea just to knock those off because I was starting to, I was starting to get some good resources. Uh, I forgot to book him. I didn't get a book. I did get another epic book, I think, from one of the challenges. So we did get one into each of these. We did get the cooldown here, which is kind of nice. Um, we did obviously ascend him so that this is 100%. Five turn cooldown, but it actually, surprisingly, the rotation works really well because the spirit affinity, she cleanses and puts a block debuffs up. And because of the rotation of when he uses it, by the time it's up again, that's down. And then we can block it and go because it can get stupid. Uh, it can get just silly. Now, we're going to need better overall gear eventually for Rocktooth to keep that going. But we still have not been able to get uh, enough ascensions here, which is unfortunate because we do want that extra turn. But it's not essential right now, so I don't want to put too much effort into it. Um, we're going to take him back here because it might be... <clears throat> That life gear might be good for him. Does have speed. Then we'll lose that speed. And that speed. And that does have... That has speed on it. Look at that. Look at that beauty roll. Look at that beauty roll. Just right from the get-go. Look at that. Two actually, No, ma'am. This is... I mean, crit damage... With accuracy and flat attack. That was the best free gear from the new player tournament I've ever seen. Hashtag not the best gear I've seen from the new player. It's trashy. Oh good. Yeah, I want a crit damage on him. Divine Life gear should have crit damage on it. That's <clears throat> I was I'm surprised. I'm not surprised. That that just happened. So we're not switching. That if we would have landed some speed there, maybe, but there's there's no point. There's no accuracy on it, so Yeah. I, I can't see myself doing that. I haven't sold this. I should just sell. I don't want to sell it yet. The reason I don't want to sell it yet is because if I need something to make a set just to help survivability briefly, I can do it. We'll sell it later. Lots of time. So, yeah, just keep keep plugging along. It's play days. Would you like a play days pack? Please, sir. I was wondering if maybe you'd want... Wait a minute. Is he in here? I was like, what happened? Can I upgrade... Really? They are already, hey? Well, we're not going to do that too often, but might as well hit that up. Am I getting the same music? It's like that old Western in the background music that I got going on. That Someone's at the piano just playing some good old... Oh no, it's it's moving along. Okay, just sound it just sounds like it's been playing this forever. Maybe not. I'm losing my mind. That's fine. All right, it's already thirty minute video. I feel like we haven't done anything. Holy crap! Well, not like I mean, this is going to be the most boring. Oh, five star barbarian ring. Uh, da, 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 da. let's get to Godfrey's crossing. Oh, on Wagon Wheel, we can get to 30, because he'll be eventually food. Though I should probably start working on level 1s <coughs> to get them up. I did accidentally take um, some, and well, some of it wasn't accidental. I just had to. So we do have a plethora of energy. My apologies to the uh, efficiency enthusiasts who are uh, the purists. 
who are like, why do you have over energy? It's inefficient. I know. But uh, I wanted the other resources. There was books and stuff to get. And potions and... Just felt like the right thing to do. I'm glad that he doesn't waste his when there's one left. There's nothing worse when there's one champion left and they use all their skills. It's not much better there, but... You say, if you don't kill him. Oh, is that Draco? Draco Morph, is that you? Is that you tickling me? They're all dead. He was a horror. We were just sitting here minding our own business, playing on a bridge, right? And then these four humanoid creatures, well, a dog, a, a man, a dark elf and his dog, and some priest, and then like a troll, they just came, they came and attacked us. We weren't even doing anything. We're just sitting on the bridge. I couldn't understand it. I mean, it's not their bridge, it's our bridge. But now they come sauntering along, just attack us. Poor Fred's dead. Poor Fred's dead. Jim's in the hospital. Like, we just... We didn't come into their lands and start attacking them. Absolute garbage. That would be amazing if we could do a full storyline from the perspective of the campaign. Enemies? Look, I'm not saying it wasn't a good idea to listen to Bad Alcazar. I'm just saying I'm Queen Eva. I'm supposed to be powerful. He offered me some power. It seemed like a good idea at the time. I mean, I didn't ask them to come into my palace. They just buzzed right in. Bloody priests and dark elves. I was going with the not wanted. Am I right? Oof. 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 Ow. Rosin, settle down. Getting a little, getting a little, you know? Got an ice maker yesterday. I can hear it making ice. It's great. I'm taking the ice because my ice maker is, keeps freezing over. Thank you, Samsung. Never buy a Samsung fridge, by the way. Ever. Never, ever, ever buy a Samsung fridge. Uh, Samsung appliance, home appliances can go away forever. They, I would rather have, I would rather have to keep my food out in the uh, frozen tundra all winter than to have another Samsung fridge. But the ice box is, the ice keeps freezing up, it keeps freezing and then blocking and you can't, doesn't make ice anymore. So I bought an ice maker, but I'm putting the ice from that ice, the portable ice maker, into the, the, the receptacle for the fridge so that it, I'll, I'll have a good amount of ice available to me really next leveling that and i will say the one downfall of an ice maker the portable one that i got compared to the one i used to have is the 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 lid is not as um insulated it's just a it's just a nice you open you can see it and so the heat causes the ice to melt too quickly in the ice maker Whereas the old one I had, by the way, the innards look identical. Like I'm sure they get them all from the same factory. Every the plug looks the same. The mechanism looks identical. I mean, it's not like there's any changes to portable ice makers in the last whatever. But <clears throat> just so you know, so you guys so you know, 
Uh, look for one with a lid that's a little more insulated instead of just showy. Because you don't need to see your ice being made. It needs, needs to be made. And then the, the insulation keeps it cooler, which means it doesn't melt quite as quick. <clears throat> it's a small thing. It's just kind of the top layer is a little bit melted by the time you it gets full. And then you want to... Uh, my last one, which I had when I was living in Calgary, we used to just let it go all the time. And we'd just fill up with water when we needed to. And if there was a party, we would we would bag some, throw it in, in the in the freezer before the party because we didn't have a built-in ice maker there but um where was i going with that oh yeah so yeah if you're gonna buy a portable ice maker look for, look for that distinct feature um anyway that's uh we're at the 36 minute mark so that seems to be par for the course uh why don't we call it a day nothing special here we're just progressing uh comments down below should I run Dragon Summon? I'm going to dra run Dragon Summon. On your free-to-play accounts, if you've had them, or, or if you're like an efficient free-to-player, did you run Dragon 7, or did you just hold off? And um, let me know in the comments down below. Have you ever used uh, Shield Guard? What do I need to do? What, what are the stats I need for him to be an eventual um, farmer for me? I'd like to know as well. So let me know in the comments down below. And uh, this is uh, this has been this has been Sunday's Freedom Tour. I will be back again tomorrow. But for those of you who see this, actually, I'll probably already be streaming by the time you see this. So maybe I'll still be streaming if you catch this right when it comes up. Uh, it depends because two K takes sometimes a few hours to uh, to render. So you may not see this till after the stream's over. But I will be streaming Monday, the Labor Day morning at ten a.m. Mountain Center time as well. So you can catch me playing Starfield, which would be fun. On the other channel, Mad Capper Plays. If you go to channels, if you have my, if you're on this page, go to channels. I now have, um, I now have my other channel there listed, as well as some of the other free to play friendly. I didn't put everyone. I'm sorry, guys. But Odd Ones channels there, and a Deadwoods channels there because, of course, the Clan Boss Calculator uh, is an important thing. I didn't put Hell Hades because, I mean, if you can't find Hell Hades. Or Ash, who are both very, very all levels of play friendly channels. Uh, if you don't know where they are by now, you probably don't know <clears throat> how you found me and not them is ridiculous. Uh, and then I think I have, uh, who else did I put there? I put out a couple other channels there. Anyway, uh, Mad Capper Plays is where I'm playing Starfield. So uh, thank you again, and we will see you tomorrow. Freedom! Awesome freedom! Um, Alright. I don't know how to end these anymore. I hate to leave you, but it's time to go. No. Bye.